Welcome again to the Uberbike Components channel. Okay, so you've just bought yourself some new brakes or some bigger disc brake rotors for your bike. If you're watching this video, then you've probably already found out that it's not quite as simple as just bolting them straight onto your bike and hitting the trails. You'll need to work out which disc brake adapter you're going to need to make it all work, and this is where the confusion can begin. So in this video, we want to give you enough knowledge to be able to identify which type of brake mounts you have, what size and which disc brake adapter you're going to need. Before we get going, please subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you don't miss out on any of our future uploads. There are various brake mount standards available, but to keep things simple, we'll just be looking at two of the most common disc brake mounts that you're likely to come across on a mountain bike, and these are post mounts and international standard mounts. You'll find that most modern frames and forks come fitted with post mounts. These are the two threaded posts that you can see on either the bottom of your fork leg or the rear of your frame, and have a centre to centre bolt measurement of 74mm. One of the benefits of this type of mount is that if the size of your disc brake rotor matches the direct mount size of your frame or fork, you can mount the brake caliper directly onto the post mounts without having to use a disc brake adapter. By now, you've hopefully identified whether your frame or fork is 160 or 180mm direct mount size. If after this video you're still unsure of this, you can always email in with images of your current brake setup so we can advise on the correct mount type that you'll need. Our email address is sales at uberbikecomponents.com We'll start by taking a fork that has a native mount size of 160mm, which is also known as post mount 6. Even though we're using a fork as an example to show this, the same brake mount selection applies for a rear post mount 6 frame mount also. So, with the caliper bolted directly to this mount, the setup is compatible with a 160mm disc brake rotor. To mount the caliper, you'll need two M6x20 brake caliper mount bolts. We'll add a link to our titanium upgrade caliper mount bolt kits in the description below. For this next part, to identify and understand the product titles of our brake mounts, post to post means that you'll be mounting a post mount caliper to a post mount frame or fork. The next part identifies the frame or fork's direct mount size, so in this case it's a post mount 6 or 160mm. This final part is the disc brake size that you'll be running, which for this example is 180mm. Staying with the same post mount 6 direct mount size, we'll now show you the setup for running a 180mm disc brake rotor. So, the brake mount needs to convert the post mount 6 up to 180mm disc brake rotor, which will need a post to post PM6 160mm to 180mm, which offsets the brake caliper by plus 20mm. To mount the caliper, you'll need to use longer bolts this time. The supply cup and comb washers help with aligning the caliper, so if you use these washers, the bolt kit you'll need is M6x38, M6x32, or M6x32, M6x28 without the cup and comb washers. We also offer the cup and comb washers in titanium, and various colour options if you wish to upgrade to them. SRAM calipers that use inline mount tabs need to have cup and comb washers between the caliper and mounts also. Due to various bolt lengths you can use depending on space setups, the adapters are not supplied with bolts and need to be purchased separately. We'll now look to fit a 203mm disc brake rotor. As we're still using the post mount 6 fork, the adapter you need is post to post PM6 160 to 203mm. This adds a 40mm offset to the brake caliper. This brake adapter requires four M6x20 bolts, two bolts to mount the adapter to the frame or fork, and two bolts to mount the caliper to the adapter. The last rotor size we'll be installing on this setup is our 220mm E Matrix disc brake rotor. To go from a PM6 direct mount to a 220mm rotor, you'll need to select our post to post PM6 160mm to 220mm adapter, which uses four M6x20 caliper mount bolts, which are available in a choice of colour options. We'll now swap over to a Fox 36 fork, as this uses a 180mm direct mount or post mount 7. Again, the following setup examples can be used for frames that come supplied with a PM7 mount type. So, as the native direct mount size of this fork is 180mm, by bolting the caliper directly onto the fork, this is now correctly spaced to accept a 180mm disc brake rotor, and uses two M6x20 bolts to mount the caliper. To run a 203mm rotor on this PM7 setup, you'll need to select the post to post PM7 180mm to 203mm disc brake adapter, which adds a plus 23mm to the caliper offset. The caliper mounting bolts you need for this disc brake adapter are M6x38, M6x32 mm if using the supplied cup and comb washers, or M6x32, M6x28 mm without the washers. The last option is a 220mm E matrix disc brake rotor. So again, going from the 180mm direct mount size of the Fox 36 fork, you'll need to select the post to post PM7 180mm 
to 220mm disc brake adapter. This uses four m 6 by 20 mm bolts, with two bolts to mount the adapter to the frame or fork, and a further two bolts to mount the caliper to the adapter. The other mount types we need to cover are the IS mounts, which stands for International Standard. Fork manufacturers have now switched over to post mounts, but IS mounts can still be found in older forks, and are still fairly commonplace on modern frames. These are unthreaded tabs that have a centre to centre measurement of 51mm and run in line with the direction of the hubs. Fitting post mount brake calipers to this frame or fork type requires a post to IS disc brake adapter. Unlike the previous mounts that can be used on either front or rear setups, you'll notice on our products page that we have these listed as front or rear specific. So if you're looking to fit a 180mm rotor onto your IS frame mount, you'll need to select the post mount to IS rear 180mm adapter. If you're mounting the same size rotor to a fork with IS tabs, then you'd select the post mount to IS front 180mm adapter. All of our IS disc brake adapters use four M6 by 20mm caliper mount bolts. Two bolts are used to hold the adapter to the frame or fork, with two bolts mounting the brake caliper to the adapter. So hopefully this video has made choosing the right disc brake mount a little easier. If you have any questions or comments on anything you've seen in this video, then please leave them in the comments section below, and thanks for watching.